scares me to be so cold. I mean, have you ever thought about, like, you know, changing your surroundings? Yeah, I'm changing my surroundings. I'm not always in the fucking coop. Well, no. I'm talking about people. Oh, no. Because I'm just basically, like, sticking to myself now. The only other person I talk to besides myself... whispers and comments of your friends wondering how you ever got so successful. If you're a student taking a test, see that big red A plus marked across the top of your exam. If you're a salesperson, see yourself actually closing the sale. If you're giving a speech, see the audience clapping for you and telling you what a wonderful job that you've done. Let's say you want a vacation home on Cape Cod or in Malibu. Picture yourself walking through the front door Noticing the color and the texture of the walls, the lawn, the roof, the entry area. Go ahead and walk through the entire home in your mind, filling in the details exactly as you would like them to be in your reality. Coming on the great day we're gonna have today. What? I'll even draw a little nose. Squeak, squeak. Our bow's arched. Squeak, squeak. We're gonna have a great day today. We're not gonna let nobody bring it down either. We're not gonna let nobody tear us down either. We stand as one united. That's all I gotta say. Your boy Devin here from Devin's World. It is December 10th. We're gonna have a great day today. Challenges is pushing themselves my way. We're not gonna let them take the best of us. We're gonna turn up. We're going to do good today. We're going to embrace that inner positive feeling. We're going to be the best version we can be of ourselves today. We're not going to let nobody tear us down today. Because at the end of the day, that's who we are. We are on the great team in the world. And nobody can beat us. Nobody can bring us down. Nobody can take us away from what we are focused on. So we're going to get it today. We're going to have fun today. We're going to turn up today. Even if it's in like a slow way. We're going to turn up today. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. You got to turn up in a certain way. You feel me? You can't be all over the place. You can't be like, oh shoot, what's going to happen next? I don't know. Oh, he doing this. He doing that. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh my gosh. It's affecting my mind. No, don't let it affect your mind. You your own person. Be you. Be you. I don't know. I'm clear I can make that. You feel me? But I'll see you in a minute. Check. Apparently, it's come to my attention that I'm supposed to make myself feel miserable for everybody else's pleasure. And you see, that's where it don't fly at. I don't fly off the handle with that. You feel me? I have to be myself. I have to entertain people on a daily basis. And even though I don't have too many subscribers yet I have to entertain, entertain people on a daily basis you know and I can't do that if, I, if my creativity is being blocked and I can't do that if I have to constantly make myself feel irrelevant and unimportant just to make other people feel happy that's just it don't fly like that you feel me it just does not fly like that and we're gonna fix that soon enough later we're gonna fix that soon enough later so yo check me out Sanctuary. Jeremy. 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 A guy should know his place in this world. So should a girl. Just because most of the world is changing doesn't mean that you have to change. So let that be like a quick lesson to you. To all you dudes out there acting like bitches. Let that be a quick lesson to you. Just because a girl wants to be a guy, I mean you gotta try to act like a girl and have female traits. 
You feel me? Don't ever think that you can fucking, you know, just look at somebody and all of a sudden you want their fucking attention. Like, I'm a fucking stranger, bro. I'm not mad or upset or nothing. I'm just speaking the honest truth here. I'm a fucking stranger, bro. And you're coming at me as if you're a female. And that might fly where, where you from, but down here in Cali, you get your ass whooped. And that's just it. That's straight up. And I'm being real about that, for real. It, it can pass today because a lot of people are like that. And I have nothing against people that are like that. People have their choice to live their life the way they want to. But when a fucking guy gets at you like that, and he wants to fucking flirt and all that bullshit and fucking make it so obvious that you fucking holding my dick while you talking to me, I don't, I don't know what to tell you. I just don't know what to tell you. It's a sad, sad world when you have to be uncomfortable with that bullshit. It's uncomfortable. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There you go. Sorry about that, letting a car come through. You gotta be comfortable with that bullshit, and it's just so sad. That's how motherfuckers are, that's how people are. That's how people are. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna apologize for what I'm saying. I'm not gonna apologize for what I'm saying, because it's all true. It's all true. And what happens is it happens every single fucking day of the motherfucking goddamn year. It's no breaks in it. It's so watered down. It's so overhyped. It's bullshit. It is bullshit. And I feel like the sooner people understand that, the better. Get your fucking dick tucked, son. Like, for real. Get your fucking dick tucked. Motherfuckers walking around here with your fucking dick exposed. Expecting somebody to fucking give you a reach around. What the fuck is that bullshit? Hell no. Nah. I don't fly that way. Like I said before, you will never see me fly off the handle that way. Like, for real. You have to understand your fucking place in life. Period. You only live once. So don't let no motherfucker try to tell you some type of bullshit. Okay, hey. Uh, you're in my fucking face more than the fucking female. Like, she's already talking to me. That should be enough right there to get me in. Why the fuck would y'all want to come up and ruin that? Honestly, either you cock blocking or either you fucking just don't even give a fuck no more. And honestly, I'm done with this shit. I'm done with it. I'm fucking done with it. I'm dead serious. I don't like shit like that. You know what? I'm going to turn to the next chapter in this vlog because I'm... I, I'm being honest, brutally honest. I'm not going to say that I'm being angry. I'm being brutally honest. So. Winning feelings. What you're doing here is bringing forward into your consciousness a positive emotion that will psychologically become connected with a future goal in your subconscious. This has the effect of anchoring that desired goal into the subconscious mind so that it's energized and becomes a subconscious reality. Now, making it happen is really quite easy because if the subconscious mind believes it, it will alter your perceptions and will look for it to make it into a reality. But we had a great day today. So we're just gonna mark that. Pretend we're marking it next. And we had a great day today. Or oh, that's what I think. I'm right about that. Cross right. Here. You can't really see it, but I got this when I used to work at a job named Chevy's. And you see this cross right here. This cross, this specific cross, I bought but never wore before. Am I a bad person for that? Like, am I a really bad person for that? If so, just please don't judge me. Do not judge me. I know it. I know I'm a bad person. There we go. Scan in action. All right. There we go. All right. We cool. Yeah, there we go. Wait. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. All right. Perfect scan in action. All right. Vlog tonight. Hope you had fun with me today. I tried my best. And uh, just know that I was there the entire time. Now, 
Um, tomorrow will there be a vlog? I have no idea. It's been raining on and off for a couple of days now. So if there's no vlog tomorrow, then I'll see you another time. But if there is a vlog tomorrow, then I'll see you tomorrow. So uh, two words only say about this vlog to end it. Vlog over. Vlog Just over. Just lying about that life. All right. See ya.